On the northeast tip of North America, on an island called Newfoundland, there's an airport. Used to be one of the biggest airports in the world. And next to it is a town called Gander. On one level, it's, it's, it's ridiculous the, uh, the places this show has taken us. It's a small place on a giant rock in the ocean. Everybody knows everybody else, and everybody in this room has a story about how they started that day. Welcome to the rock if you come from away hey! You probably understand about a half of what we see hey! They say no man's an island but an island makes a you look at the actual story that inspired it, that inspired us it, You know, it, it makes complete sense to us because it's this incredible story Now to a story about 9-11 that may have happened over a thousand miles from New York City But its inspiration hit very close to home Arthur Chien tells us about the Tony Award nominated musical on Broadway That shows us the true essence of hope and humanity I read a quote one time that said, go not where there is a path, instead go and make a trail. For what you do for yourself dies with you, but what you do for others lives on. On September 11, 2001, when airspace across the U.S. was shut down following the attacks, Gander's small airport would take in international flight after international flight. 38 planes carrying 7,000 passengers and dozens of animals would be forced to land there, essentially doubling the population of the town. What we saw was 7,000 frightened people, and, and they needed love, and they needed compassion, and they needed shoulder to cry on. In the aftermath of 9-11, the story of Gander resonated back here at home, especially for writers Irene Sankoff and David Hind, who were in New York when the towers were hit. On the 10th anniversary of the attacks, both would travel to Newfoundland to interview countless Gander residents and the involuntary guests they host to uncover a story of humanity and kindness. The fact that it's you know now here in Australia and the show has gotten so much recognition, that just is beyond our wildest dreams. Come from away! Come from away! And the Olivier goes to Kelly, Kelly Devine, Devine for Come From Away. fell in love with it and the fact that the world is falling in love with it too um, I mean it, it you know it's wonderful to us but it, uh, it's, it's more wonderful that we're celebrating the people who did this amazing thing 38 diverted planes 7,000 stranded passengers and one small town that welcomed them all that's the Broadway hit come from away This stirring and inspiring musical takes you to a place you'll never want to leave. Best musical winner around the world. Book at comefromaway.com.au